Artie Marino is staying. What's going on, everybody? We've got breaking news on a Monday. This is John Frisch, one half of Locked On Angels. I host the show with my brother Mike. And this was not the uh, the plot twist that we saw coming in this whole Angels ownership situation. The Angels announced, Artie Marino announced, the Marino family announced that they're staying. They're not selling the team. The exploratory process is over. <sighs> Excuse me. And here's the thing, friends. We had hope for 2023. Even with all the uncertainty around the team, we felt like Perry Manassian did a pretty good job in putting a team together in 2023. We thought that new ownership could convince Shohei Otani to stay in Anaheim. We were excited for new ownership who actually wanted to put a winning product on the field. And now we've got the same owner the last 20 years who for the last 10 years has turned this into a marketing machine. It's a money-making machine. It's always been a money-making machine and it will continue to remain that way as long as the money keeps rolling in. They can neglect the minor leagues. They can neglect the Spanish broadcasting situation. They can neglect their relationship with the fans. They can continue to have a bad relationship with the city of Anaheim. Who knows if they're going to get a stadium deal done. We've got backdoor politics and... Ay, ay, ay. This is the man who's staying. This is the family who's staying. The same people that are in charge that we were excited to see go are staying. Now, maybe this means that there's a long-term plan for Shohei Otani. Who knows? That's like a silver lining because that means management stays the same. General manager stays the same. Possibly Phil Nevin stays. Who knows? But all of this to say, everything that's wrong with the Halos that we were excited about going away is going to continue to remain wrong. Mike and I get accused a lot of being too positive or being too enthusiastic about the halos. We just love our team. And, and generally, we're just enthusiastic guys. But I would encourage you to tune in to Lockdown Angels tomorrow morning. We're going to record our episode tonight. Get that out for you so you have it first thing tomorrow morning. We hope you'll tune in, YouTube, wherever you get your podcasts, and you'll see just how uh, enthusiastic we can be. Hope you find uh, a way to cope in a healthy way. Meanwhile, I'll see you on Lockdown Angels.